welcome to A Year of Joy. My name is Sherry Elise and I will be your joy reporter. Every single week I will be introducing you to one of your joy superpower partners. On behalf of the team of the art and science of joy, we are thrilled to be able to bring this to you. So without further ado, let's meet your joy superpower partner. Welcome back to A Year of Joy. I am excited to introduce you to our upcoming Joy Superpower expert on storytelling, Karen Golden. Hi, Karen. Hi, Sherry. How are you? Doing great. I'm excited to chat with you today because I want to know a little bit, if you could tell us a little bit about your personal journey with storytelling. Well, you know, I am a storyteller and it is a long story, but I'll see if I can tell this story very quickly. So I am the sixth of six children. And in my family growing up, we used to tell stories around our dinner table. And in order for me to get any airtime at the dinner table, I had to have a very good story to tell. So I started my storytelling journey when I started to talk <laughs> and we would pass stories around the table. For me, this led to a love of oral communication. And I really enjoyed telling stories, uh, giving speeches. This led to a love of radio. And I did radio in my childhood. And then later on, I was a talk show host on public radio and I interviewed a storyteller. And I thought, hmm. I could do that. And I've been doing it now for almost 33 years. So that's wow. my journey in a nutshell. <laughs> wow. No, I love it. I love that it started with your childhood and just being there and needing to have that space, that, that stage to see yourself and then be able to carry that over into your professional life. Yes. So for, so for others, why do you think that storytelling is so important for people to cultivate in their lives? First of all, everyone is a storyteller. It's part of being human. It's one of the most basic necessities of human beings. First, there's shelter, there's food, or maybe not in that order. There's food, and then there's shelter, and then there's stories. Because storytelling is the glue that connects us with other people. It's the glue that connects us with our past, our present, and our future. And stories also bring people joy. Now I participate in the art of oral storytelling. So my art form is very low tech. All I need is my mouth and humans <laughs> and <laughs> listeners and my art form can, can happen. But we all love storytelling in the form of movies as well. And movies are a higher tech form of storytelling, but who doesn't love hearing a good story? And stories, not only bring me joy, I believe that they bring everyone joy because it's the way we connect with people. It's the way that we show our humanity. And it's the way that we can build empathy with other people. Because when you hear a story of someone else's life, it's as if you are living in that person's shoes and you can empathize with the journey that they've been on. And that's one of the most amazing aspects of storytelling is how it connects all of us. Karen, we are so excited to have you in the Year of Joy community and can't wait to learn more from you about storytelling and really the link with joy, because I could tell in these few moments, these few minutes together, how much joy you have brought me. So we look forward to being with you. And, and I look forward to being with you <laughs> and sharing my love and passion for storytelling with all of you. Thank you all. Thanks, Karen.